The AI uprising in the outer rim is getting out of control. More ships are being detected by the day and the fleet is having trouble. Join the Fallen now, get named, see your ship fight in the series and stay tuned till the end to see how well you have done. Greetings, models. I am the Fallen Shogun, and we are not docking here. We're going to help out this battle. So we're going to deploy a lot of our ships, I think. Unless anything exciting happens, it should be a good case of the, penin the, peninsula, the peninsula maneuver. What's going to happen is we're going to use the station as our primary shield, or our rock, and we're going to be the wings. We're basically going to spread out around it and watch as my frame rate dies, and then hopefully the AI forces will follow suit. Although in this case, I decided I'm just going to go ram the Morthen. Hello, Morthen. No! And now I travel faster. I'm traveling faster in a spin than I would be if I had my engines, because my boost never ended. Now, the only issue we're going to have, I think, will be combined cruisers pushing us in, or their big ship. Which is apparently called the Yoda Whiskey. So when we take Yoda's whiskey from him, which has apparently become sentient and is now leading AI battle fleets, it joined the Separatists. Yoda's whiskey joined the Separatists. After we've done all of that, we should be able to easily wrap this up. So I don't expect anything too exciting in this battle apart from my frame rate hitting single digits. My god. I think I brought in too many things. Seven squadrons are here. Oh my god. Look at this. Oh my god. Oh, there it is. Yoda's whiskey is pushing in. Yeah, my forces are pushing up. Looks like the station is going to take the bulk of the murder, though. So that's going to be a bit of meh. In fact, my force is still really catching up. Okay, let's put you to here. So yeah, the flank where the main station isn't, we're going to push forwards. The flank where the main station is, they're going to hold their position and hopefully, you know, be annoying. Because we don't really want to push in while it has a huge amount of support. And right now, oh, look at that front line. That is nice. Right now, look at all those bloody lasers. It has a lot of support. If anything, I hope it wins best supporting actor. Because, I mean, Whiskey doesn't get to be main actor. Oh, he's pushing in. But the more little ones we kill, the better, of course. Oh my god. So they're rushing it, so yeah, we don't really want to lose the station. Oh god, I'm sorry, Speedle New. What's that, fourth Speedle you've ever had? Oh, piece of the station just blew up. That's not good. Push, push, push. The more station we lose, the worse it's going to be for the next time we have to do this exact same trick. So apart from me headbutting Yoda's whiskey in the face, nothing eventful really happened. And if Yoda's down, a couple of more small ships are mop up, but yeah, I headbutted Yoda's whiskey in the face, my ship caught fire, my weapons went down, and then 20 bombers wiped it out of the skies. So yeah, let's go see what we got. And we got an Alpha Core, yes! Now, I skipped some of the combat. As you know, I don't like skipping combat when there's named people on the field. And obviously, I will skip stuff like when they're trying, you know, just backing away, stuff like that. Because it's very annoying when the AI is just backing away into a corner and you can't catch them. But I don't like actually skipping watching ships destroy other ships. So I'm going to have to figure out a happy medium there. 
just gonna keep that. But yeah, we'll have to figure out what that will be in the future. More luxes, wisdoms, get rid of those. Yeah, so that's a thing. We've got time now, we've got equipment, we've got resources. Uh another remnant coming in. Wow. Really? Oh wait, resources. Oh wow, they interdicted me and ran away. Little sods. But yeah, this will keep us going. Oh, what is that? There's two different types. Oh, that's the two things. I remember those. What are they? Uh, what is that? Don't recognise it. The Omega Abomination. What is this? Omega Abomination. Okay. We're deploying for all the squadrons again. The Omega Abomination. And we did the exact same strategy, only there's less station to help us with this. So let's hope for the best. God, this station's definitely seen better days, hasn't it? Look at this. One entire section is gone. The rest of it's on fire and smouldering. Just like my CPU is. And very soon, just like their CPUs are. So, looks like initial waves are down. But there's a lot more. Which one's that one? What are you? You're the solar class strike drone ship battle carrier. You're the false Omega. Okay. Wait, what do you look like? Flatter. You're a flatter one. Okay. One's got shoulder pads, one's got wings. Because I don't recognise that. False Omega. Have I ever fought a False Omega? I must have. Do I care? Who knows? Sometimes you fight things and you don't quite realise if you care or not. But yeah, we're doing okay. Pretty sure it's the time travelling bloody ships doing it. I think they're affecting my ability to travel from normal speed. Uh oh, oh, it's pushing, it's pushing. My forces are still moving, the bigger ships are still at the back. Of course, we won't. Oh, we're here to try and bring them into the fold. Without, you know, the station folding, and it's turning its damage section to them. We don't really want that. But we might end up with it. As long as we keep some pressure on the bloody thing, we'll be fine. That's a false. Oh my god, look at that thing. Okay. Right wing is pulling back. Two of them Are dead yet. I love how my my time destroyers are literally bullying their AI cruisers. That's awesome. Okay, glimmer went down. You don't really care about glimmers, if I'm honest. No one cares about cares about glimmers. They're just a glimmer in the eye before they explode like a big pizza pie. That's Samori. There's so many things. I'm just going to straight up put a, an avoid warning on that one. Pushing one at least. Oh my god, the frames are dipping towards 10 again. It's going to be time travel. I didn't have this issue before. Obviously, I do a lot of things in between episodes. I don't kill anything, of course, because that would ruin the whole point of having a kill counter. But I do do tests. Simulation tests. Look at that thing. I 
It looks like we've cleaned the house mostly on this side. Good, okay. The, right, the flank has changed. Obviously, we're still doing a solid line. Only the right flank's moved down. The left flank has pushed up. Are you fireborn? Your, your fireborn is pushing. Followed by the Omicron. We have the Vega. And we have the Zombie Moses pushing. Zombie Moses. That's what it says on the tin. He's here to part the Red Sea. The Red Sea will be made out of your blood. If you're AI, don't worry. We can add blood. Okay, this one is finally taking some major hits. The other one is currently being massively engaged by fighters. It looks like we finally have the kills going on. So this one is now in trouble. Obviously, it could be even more in trouble, but I'll take in trouble for now. Just keep up the pressure and it'll disappear. Everything else, no one really cares about. We just want to wipe out the Omega and the Zodiacal, Zodiacal Light? That's not a real phrase. Okay, the battle carrier is going down. The Moses and the Fireborn help me destroy it. And there it goes. Now to wipe out the Abomination. Oh my god, look at the weapon system. Oh, the foot's gone, and so's one of the wings. It must have got hit by a massive bomber strike. Good, good die. Oh my god, it did get hit by a man. Look at that. Okay. That's called the Nova class? The Nova class Omega Abomination. I guess it was just the name of the ship. Okay, fine. Screw you. The Omega Abomination. Typical. Let's just clean up the house. And they're all gone. Let's have a little look. Ah, another AI core. I was like, hoping for two, but I'll take it. So we now have 130, 360, 290k. 120, 240, 360. 690k. 750k, give or take. Four and a half. Like, one and a half million. I have two million and change in uh, cores right now. So it might be time to say goodbye to this place. We're having a few issues with the locals, of course, and I don't really want them to uh, completely destroy my CPU. Now, of course, we can just come back, but I think we're doing quite okay. We can always return at some other point in the future. They've given us a lot of money, and there's always more of them. This is literally the best place to ever hunt, because there's always more. Anyway, let's head back to the core. Oh, that's a battleship. Yeah, head back to the core worlds. Good luck. Wait, Fortune class drone ship. What? What? That can't be right. No. All right, sorry. Let's just head back to the core worlds. You know, one thing I love seeing in this situation is just all the money rolling in. Let's go boop, boop, boop. 2.1 million credits. Just, it gives this warm feeling inside, which goes, I wish I was a millionaire, but I'm not. I'm just a poor guy with a fleet and thousands of pilots prepared to die. We lost 300 pilots in the last battle, bloody hell. So I just sold some things, uh, bought some more supplies, I decided I need to find some softer targets. Unfortunately, my soft targets having an issue already. Spear of Kindness and the Rod of Justice. Wow, there's a porn movie being made over here. So I was going to go here and wipe things out. Instead, I'm just going to watch and steal resources. But I doubt we'll get anything nice. But, yeah. This is literally where I was going to be. 
Obelisk class yacht. Well, that's a fancy name for it. What is this? The arch yacht. Wow. They sent they sent a yacht into war. Now it's nice that they're actually doing this, but like I say, I'd have very much liked to kill them. So I might have to go into their sector. So I'm gonna hit the church. Because I quite frankly want one of their big massive um Super capitals. I love their super capitals. I always do. But they're being annoying. Never mind. Never mind. I wish they were annoying again. Oh, no, 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 no. I think Comlink. Oh, my God. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, ten of those. Ten, seven, fourteen, fifty, sixty, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty. Twenty-two destroyers! This is meant to be an easy target. This is going to kill my system. Okay. Capture. Uh, assault. Defend. Defend. Let's watch my CPU die. Oh! Oh, I just rammed an allied ship. There's an allied ship with me. Why is that allied ships with me? Why are they following me in? I'm sorry, little ship. So what I was bloody going to do is just fight softer targets to have smaller battles. Instead, we have more fighters and time travel. The two things which break my CPU happening than at any one point in the game. And I can't deploy lesser stuff because these things hit... Like a ton of time traveling bricks that know where you are as a kid. So this, this is my pain life now. And also, our allies have come in and are mostly shepherds for some godly reason. Well, no, no, cancel that. Come back. There's, there's, like, why are there all my allied forces shepherds? We don't need any more fighters. So we need to wipe out the carriers first, then the time travellers. Okay, they've both pulled back. They can now pull back into the main force. My god. And the fact that all the uh, time travelling fighters deploy copies of themselves as well. It's insane. Genuinely insane. How are we doing? Some minor engagement going on, that's fine. Okay, let's start hitting that right flank. There's a cow over there, I might be able to kill. Oh god, the turning! Get better frame rate than I do with the bloody AI ships, though. I'm not saying it's good, but I'm getting better. Oh no, allies, 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 shepherd, shepherd! I overloaded it by ramming it. Vega! Okay, looks like that carries down, so we do have the advantage on the flank. The centre's definitely theirs, and the left flank is... who knows? The Aura Knight's having fun on it, though. God, that shows you how bad the frame rate is. That shows you... Doof, 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 doof. Not duh. 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 If I put a black and white mar uh, screen over this, you can almost imagine them doing this as some kind of um, thematic system. Oh my god. Goes over there. Chase after it. Uh oh, it's Kierke. No! Shield down! Shield down! It's Kierke! Shield down! It's Kierke! Shield down! It's Kierke! 
Okay, we're pushing in now. So we're trying to take the right flank. It's not going well. One of their little ships has died, but no one really cares. Their little ships are basically garbage. Unless they have the numbers or the outflanking manoeuvres. They can't outflank us. So they can't get into their murder position. So we are pushing on these carriers. And I've told my three uh, battle cruisers to push this way. So they are pushing forward and I'm going with them. So hopefully we actually get some firepower as the fighters come in. Oh. The more these carriers we destroy, the better. Because their destroyers do not have the CR to stay in a prolonged fight. They do not have it at all. And a lot of them came in damage for some reason. So we're pushing forwards. Okay, the Katana went down. That's another carrier. Not sure who's getting these kills anymore. I'm going to have to check your names at the end. I apologise. Looks like we're winning the war though. We've got all the destroyers. In one big bundle, that's what we gotta do. We gotta keep them corralled and hit from all sides. Their fighters are powerful, but they only have a few of them. Now, my fighters are sometimes powerful, and we have 5,000 million of them. I didn't buy any more infantry. I'm gonna run out of pilots. Another katana went down, that's good. The katanas are the fighters, I mean, not the carriers. Oh god, that. Skiff owners are the destroyers, finally got one of those down. On the bright side, I've been after more of their time travelling fighters. The amount of carriers these guys are showing should give me a few. Okay, we're going to do a full-on assault now. What's that one? Never mind. Okay, so we're pushing in. This carrier's nearly dead. Carriers behind it are going falling. There's another badly damaged one at the back. I think that one came in that way. We're taking the flank. We're really pushing the flank now. So only a couple of uh, ships are out of the net. We just need to close the net. Which is difficult, because all of their ships are trying to escape out of the bloody system. Oh, in the past, I wanted these fighters, these carriers. I think they only carry like two ships each. At the very beginning of the run, these would have been great carriers. Now I need more fighters. Sorry about that, Frenetic. I know you love your ship. But you're still so shiny to me. Okay, you have you the Iskier because of the cannon. You are the Omicron because of the weapon systems. That makes you're the Lapsus. That means you're the Fireborn. Yep. Okay, I'm starting to recognise ships by the weapon systems on them. It only took a long time. Another one down. This is end game now. It's just going to take time. Just going to take time. Yes, it's very much the end game. They've completely lost. run out of CR. Full assault. This is it. We're clearing them all out. It's just going to be a massive smorgasbord of murders. Nothing exciting will happen. Look at this. None of them have any shields. This is, apart from like these ones at the very back, the front line is entirely on fire. And even the ones with shields are like 67%. Alright, let's wipe them all out. So that took a lot more time than I'd be happily comfortable talking about. The buggers escaped with enough fleet to engage me a second time, and then they retreated after that so I had to engage them again as they were running away, or my allies would have taken all of the resources. Oh my god, that was just a mess. And we gained some s docks and some Kutch Bulgars, so I regained the resources we needed, but my gods. 
That was just a nightmare. Anyway, I've been the Fallen Shogun. I'm going to have to quickly check up all the numbers of everyone who survived, lived, did and stuff. And I will see you guys next one. Take care. Be awesome. Be epic. Be amazing. Tell a cared one you love about them. You love. Tell a cared one you love them. Just in case. Because you never know what will happen. Because things do happen. And I will see you next time. Stay safe out there. Oh.